Well, I think we serve because um, of what not only it does for other people, the people who we serve, but also what it does for ourselves. You can't look at our world around us, and especially for those of you who are pre-health students, and not see that there is legitimate need all around us. Um, people who don't have access to healthcare or don't know how to navigate the healthcare system. And so I think that we serve because there's need. And when we are people in a position to help others, of course we wanna help other people. Um, the byproduct is how we are affected when we serve other people. And it's so funny, you can think of stories of um, when you kind of begrudgingly go um, to help others, maybe your schedule is full, you don't really want to, you don't have the time, you're tired, and yet then you go and you work with people who um, have less and yet they're so full of joy. Um, they don't have what you have, yet they don't need it. And you're reminded, that's who I wanna be. I wanna be someone who's content and satisfied and aware that I don't have to have what the world tells me I have to have um, to be happy or to be satisfied. And so I think that's why we serve. It's to serve other people, but also so that we're developed as human beings. Compassion and empathy are two variables that are crucial in the healthcare world. Compassion is an emotional response to sympathy and creates a desire to help. Empathy is our feeling of awareness towards other people's emotions and an attempt to understand how they feel. Service is an incredible way to develop these traits, where you're able to learn how to properly interact with and better understand others who you work with and who you care for. It will be our responsibility as future healthcare professionals to make our patients feel heard and valued. Your undergraduate years are a great time to be aware of how we can improve upon these skills through volunteering in our Waco community. Healthcare at its core is serving and healing the sick and suffering. So the very foundation of healthcare itself is compassion, a deep desire to lift others out of suffering. Since we all want to be in healthcare, then at some level, deep down, we all care about helping others who are needy. I've definitely been a patient <laughs> numerous times in my life. And I can tell those medical professionals who um, have service as part of something that they do regularly because they see me as more than just a body and a person and someone to fix. They recognize that I'm much more complex than that. And there's a compassion and a wealth of knowledge um, that is different from those practitioners I've had that only care about fixing my illness or fixing my broken bone. And so I just think for anyone that's in the pre-health um, field, it's crucial for you to expand your boundaries, to recognize that there's so much more um, to our humanness than just our physical body. And when you serve others, you have an opportunity to experience that in real world. You know, I think it's easy to watch a video or to read a book and hear people's experiences. But when you're there, when you are seeing and tasting and building relationships with people who are completely different than you, then it affects who you are and it changes you little by little. And I think it changes you for the best. Another important benefit of service is that it builds your cultural competency. Cultural competency is defined as the ability to understand and effectively interact with people across different cultures. You may have heard this term or something similar applied in the context of interacting with people in general, especially if you've recently entered a college setting where you're expected to interact with people different from you on a daily basis. However, this concept also has specific con consequences in the context of healthcare. Culturally competent providers are willing to understand and communicate with patients from a different background than their own, and they understand that this aspect of their work is just as important as any clinical endeavor. As an aspiring healthcare practitioner, it's very easy to focus more on acquiring knowledge to work in the profession while ignoring the growth and empathy necessary to effectively serve a community. This attitude may result in harmful or stereotypical beliefs about certain communities or groups of people persisting and affecting the quality of care provided in the future.
Service is the stepping stone to fully understanding the meaning of compassion and how crucial it is in the world of medicine. Volunteering not only serves those you work with, but it serves you as well. It is through these experiences that you will be able to better understand the importance of compassion and empathy and how prominent it would be in your future working in the healthcare world. We are so excited to help you discover the importance of service in your Baylor pre-health career.